What's happening, everybody? Jay Shockblast here, and we are back to show off another character from the Black Panther movie character and level pack, and that is Eric Killmonger. This is the Golden Jaguar himself, and I have to say, uh, this is a really cool figure in the game because he's got that change where he changes into Eric Killmonger. And they definitely did an amazing job of showing that off. Uh, behind you have the comic version of Killmonger that we've seen uh, many times before uh, in this game and in DLC, Black Panther DLC for Lego Marvel's Avengers. So this is the Michael B. Jordan version of Killmonger, and he's awesome. I mean, he is really a, a showstopper in the movie. And he is quite possibly one of Marvel's best villains in the Marvel Cinematic Universe to date. Uh, a lot of people are saying he could be the best, but I am still going to side with Loki, uh, although he might have topped Hela for me. So uh, this is just uh, the compliment of all compliments. And the transformation here is amazing. That, what you just saw uh, for his transformation, is something that you do see in the trailer for the movie. And it's only something that I think he does once in the movie. So it's basically the only time that you kind of see it. Um, I was pretty vocal in the lead up to the movie about not being a fan of him having the exact same suit as Black Panther. But in the context of the story, they did explain it. And it does make sense, and I can live with it, uh, why they kind of went that direction. My biggest fear was that a lot of the times, you know, we look at some of the villains that we've seen in the Marvel Cinematic Universe, and they're very, very similar to their adversary. You know, you look at Yellow Jacket, you look at Iron Monger, you look at even Whiplash kind of had his own suit. And, uh, you know, Iron Man was also going up against all the mechs in that movie. Um, so, I mean... It's just not something I really wanted to see them continue to lean on like a crutch. I wanted to see some differentiation between the villains. And while we didn't really necessarily 100% get that in terms of aesthetics, we definitely got it in terms of attitude. Um, Michael B. Jordan just absolutely nailed it as Killmonger. And I really think that it's going to change the way Marvel and, quite frankly, even DC and other characters uh, are approached as far as villains are concerned. Uh, this is obviously a very important movie uh, in the comic book industry because it's just a lot of a lot of newness, a lot of things they've never done before. You know, Black Panther is not necessarily a character in his own right that you would have thought would have been able to carry a movie, and he did beautifully. And then, of course, there is the, you know, cultural uh, aspect of it, the diversity aspect of it, all of those things. Very, very important to see this movie do well, and it is, and it's not just because of that. And that, to me, is the best part. Um because I think we've seen situations where, you know, things will be supported by all the critics, but it doesn't translate into commercial success. We're seeing that in the actual comic books. You know, we look at a lot of the series out there. I don't want to say any specific ones, but, you know, there are series out there that are just absolutely celebrated by critics, and then it comes time for people to buy it, and they just don't. And, you know, the heart was in the right place, but it just doesn't translate. This translates. I think anybody that goes to see it can just feel the power. And uh, Michael B. Jordan's a big reason for that. Uh, he, you could feel the, the heart in, in the, the heartbreak and the trials and the tribulation that his character has gone through that's led him down this path uh, towards becoming a villain. It's not 100%, obviously, with the comic, but it's, it's very close and I just really, really think they did just a fantastic job with it. And uh, I, I can't rave enough about, you know, Michael B. Jordan as Eric Killmonger. He, he was just phenomenal. Um, so, you know, I would love to know what other people thought of it if you've seen the movie yet. I think this figure is, uh, it's really good. And I know there's a lot of people that kind of feel like they would have liked to have seen 
Um, you know, they would have liked to have seen Black Panther kind of have the same transition, the same... Um, what, I, what am I trying to say? The, the same, uh, you know, this transition where he changes. And, you know, I kind of agree with that. Uh, especially considering how the suit you know, comes to be, you know, I think that is a fantastic point, um, that it really could have happened. I don't want to spoil any, I don't want to have any spoilers in the movie. Um, I really kind of feel like it, this is a movie you got to see. It's definitely one of those movies that I feel like people that don't even normally go to the movies are going to see. And, and that to me is the ultimate compliment. So, uh, I really just feel like I love this figure. I mean, I love this this transformation. I think I was one of the first people to kind of spot it um, and, and post about it. So that is incredible. I hate the lighting in this game. I'm just going to say it. Um, it's never easy to get good lighting. Like right now I have good lighting, but... It's it's not facing a direction I want to. I know these things seem might seem silly, but like I don't know. I just think they get a little carried away with it. But in any event, uh, this is Eric Killmonger and his Black Panther costume. And if we go into the menu here, uh, we can see his card. It's gonna tell us a little bit about him. Here's Eric Killmonger. Uh, the card is basically the same. Uh, whether you have it on Killmonger or his actual suit. Uh, so you can see that he has target. Uh, he does repair. He has enhanced senses, uh, acrobat, technology, and vine cut. Uh, Eric Stevens was an American black ops soldier who earned the name Killmonger while in the field. However, after disappearing off the grid, he has re-emerged with a plan that threatens to put Black Panther and all of Wakanda at risk. Using his charisma, considerable skills in combat, and his surprising knowledge of Wakandan customs, Eric Killmonger is a dangerous threat to all that T'Challa holds dear. And that is uh, definitely the truth. Uh, <laughs> you, you have to say, he, uh, he did quite well in surprising everybody. So, there is that. Um, so that is the latest in our Black Panther show-off series. Again, I didn't rush them all out because I didn't want to, uh, I don't know, didn't want to overwhelm them, but, you know, we've got the, the, the Black Panther. So, uh, Eric Killmonger, there he is. Hope everybody enjoyed the video. We'll see you.